The Flair Nation YouTube game, what to do, man? This your boy Duffy. You already know the vibes, man. We're back with another daily. Oh my god, bro, we just hit the wall. But look, y'all, we're back with another daily video as usual. But look, y'all, before having a video today, man, go ahead and stop what y'all doing, man, and make sure y'all drop a like on the video right now. It is much appreciated, man. And if you didn't know, man, dropping a like on the video helps push the video to recommend it, which allows more people to see and view the video, which all in our builds the La Flair Nation, our builds the family up. You know, what's better than recruiting more family members to the squad, you feel me? And um, if you're new to the channel, man, you did not know, I post every single day on YouTube, man. I'm currently on a six-month streak of daily uploads, man. We're about to hit this seven months of daily uploading. You know, it's all litty, bro. So, hey, do not forget to hit that subscribe button for your boy, man. It's much appreciated. We about to hit this 2.5K too, man. Hey, shout out to the game, bro. I love y'all boys for that, man. Y'all some real ones, bro. I really mess with y'all a long way, I swear. But, um, oh, yeah, make sure y'all turn on y'all post notifications so you do not miss the daily bangers every single day too, man. But, look, y'all, ain't gonna waste too much more of y'all's time with this chit-chat, man. We're gonna jump straight in. Yeah, if you're hearing this man, you got caught lacking, man. Make sure you hit that like button and make sure you hit that subscribe button. All right, y'all, we back. As you can see from the thumbnail and the title today, man, I got the top three most overpowered playmaking badges in NBA 2K21 next year, man. These playmaking badges are definitely overpowered, y'all, and I definitely recommend y'all boys to put these badges on because, listen, y'all, it's going to change y'all's game and it's going to improve y'all's game so much, man. And I feel like these badges, these three playmaking badges are definitely necessities and they definitely help you and benefit your player a whole lot, bro. I'm telling y'all now, bro, you put these playmaking badges on, you're gonna go crazy, bro. And um, if you didn't know, man, I just dropped a video on the shooting badges. So if you, hey, y'all see what I'm doing, man? It's a series. So look, we're gonna we're gonna go all the way through all the badges, man, to help y'all boys get the best possible badge loadout for y'all, so y'all can go crazy in the park, go crazy and win the games, man. Get that win percentage up, bro. Y'all know the vibes with that. But look, we ain't gonna waste too much more time. Man. Let's get into it. Starting out with the playmaking badges, bro. We're gonna look, we're gonna take all these off, bro. We're gonna take all these off. Alright. Now, I'm gonna do the top three most overpowered badges, and I'm gonna show y'all the other badges I rock as well. For the first, I mean for the third, we're gonna go backwards, y'all. Third most overpowered badge in this game, y'all. Third most overpowered, bro. Definitely quick first step, third most overpowered. I definitely say this because Quick first step is kind of a necessity badge, but it's overpowered at the same time. Because if you do not have this badge, you're going to be moving like a turtle, bro. Literally. And um, if, once you get this badge on here, bro, you'll notice the significant difference when you get it on Hall of Fame compared to none. And, bro, it's overpowered, bro. That's the... If you don't know about quick first step, man, it just makes your player so much more faster, bro. You don't move like a snail. The second most overpowered badge is definitely um ankle breaker now if you get this on hall of fame y'all you're going to go crazy bro the ankle breakers are ridiculous in this game man there's so many of them man shout out to 2k for that and um the ankle breakers are man you do a step back you do a, a snatch back you do a hesitation a behind the back you can get ankle breakers off of this year bro and it's overpowered y'all this combined with ball handling boost is overpowered y'all i'm telling you now y'all heard it here first man ankle breaker is overpowered with the ball handling boost too, bro. Oh my goodness, bro. And if you have it on Hall of Fame, oh my god, bro. I be catching ankles with just gold ankle breaker. But if I, if you have a Hall of Fame, bro, it's a GG. I ain't gonna lie. Um, but yeah, if you don't know what, you know, if you're fairly new to 2K, man, I'm always just pull up the badge info for you so you can pause the video and read that for yourself, man. Just try to help y'all new boys out. Now, for the most overpowered badge in this game, the number one, man. Number one is definitely special delivery, aka flashy passer. If you didn't know what this is, man, take over boost from both the passer and, re and receiver after a flashy assist. Additionally, this badge increases alley -oop throw success and shot chance for receivers after a flashy pass. So basically, let's say we're in the wreck and we get two flashy passes and our teammate greens both of those flashy passes. Your team has team takeover, bro. It's overpowered, y'all. I'm telling you now, same for his part, man. You get one flashy pass. Yeah, I mean, you get two flash passes, you green them, you team take over both your teammates, bro, or threes or whatever you want. But special delivery is so overpowered, John. It's so slip on. It's ridiculous, man. This badge goes so crazy, man. And if you haven't tried it out yet, man, go ahead and try it out, man. 
I got it on Hall of Fame, but you can put this on gold and it does the same thing. But I like to rock with a Hall of Fame, just my preference. But yeah, man, man, my bro. These three badges right here are definitely overpowered, y'all. I'm telling y'all, y'all need to try y'all need to try these out, bro. Literally, they're overpowered. But um the um for the rest of my badges, y'all, this is my badge setup, handles for days, I'm pluckable, bailout, bullet passer, and that's about it, man. You don't need diamond because it's easy to shoot in this game. And you should be, your teammates should be able to shoot, bro. Just keep it on with y'all, bro. Your teammates should be able to shoot. So diamond's not really necessary. Bailout works the same thing on bronze as silver, gold, and hall of fame. So why waste badge points? You feel me? Um, bullet passer definitely recommend rocking this silver or higher because it helps out a whole lot. You know, I'm pluckable. You know, I already know. you already know I'm pluckable. But if y'all enjoyed this video today, man, make sure y'all let me know down in the comment section. I will reply to every single one of y'all boys' comments, man. Shout out to y'all, bro. We about to hit this 2.5K, man, today. And, bro, hey, man, shout out to the gang, man. Shout out to the gang. The Flair Nation in it, bitch. <laughs> bro, appreciate y'all boys so much, man. But, look, if I see y'all boys in my next video, drop it tomorrow morning. Or if I see y'all in my next stream later on tonight, I'm going to see y'all boys when I see y'all. And I'm out.